The NEB Express cell-free E. coli protein synthesis system can synthesize protein in just two to four hours. This system includes all of the components needed for protein synthesis, a highly active cell extract, an optimized T7 RNA polymerase, an RNase inhibitor, and a protein synthesis reaction buffer containing energy source, nucleotides, and amino acids. All that is required is a template containing the gene of interest under the control of a T7 RNA polymerase promoter. The template DNA must contain an in-frame start codon, an in-frame stop codon, a T7 promoter, an upstream ribosome binding site, a downstream spacer region, and a downstream T7 terminator. Template can be plasmid DNA, linear DNA, or mRNA. While higher yields are often obtained with a plasmid DNA, linear DNA or PCR products can generate acceptable yields and provide time-saving advantages. PCR fragment can be synthesized using primers to add upstream and downstream elements, such as the T7 promoter and terminator. All DNA or mRNA templates should have a complete T7 terminator or the minimal T7 stem loop, as it will enhance mRNA stability. Template purity is also important. We recommend using a mini prep kit or a DNA cleanup kit to isolate plasmid or linear DNA. Once the template DNA is purified, thaw the NEB Express cell free E. coli protein synthesis system components on ice. Gently vortex the NEB Express S30 synthesis extract and protein synthesis buffer to mix. Combine the following in a 1.5 mL microcentrifuge tube 12 microliters of NEB Express S30 synthesis extract. 25 microliters of 2x protein synthesis buffer, 1 microliter of T7 RNA polymerase, 1 microliter of RNase inhibitor, 250 nanograms of DNA template, and nuclease free water to a total reaction volume of 50 microliters. Incubate reactions at 37 degrees Celsius with shaking for 2 to 4 hours. The system routinely produces approximately 25 micrograms of protein per 50 microliter reaction or one half milligram per milliliter. Following incubation, the reaction can be stored frozen or analyzed by your method of choice. For SDS page or western blots, combine two microliters of reaction with sample buffer and load directly on the gel. It is unnecessary to precipitate the sample with acetone or TCA. The components of this system do not interfere with gel electrophoresis. The synthesized protein can be isolated by affinity purification, for example, using NEB Express nickel NTA magnetic beads or NEB Express nickel spin columns for further analysis. To learn more, visit www.neb.com E5360.